everyone, my name is Nicole, and welcome to The Fairy, another indie horror game found on Itch.io. Uh, as always, link in the description below, and we are going to hit that enter button to go in. Prologue, I was looking through the job section when I found an ad for a ferryman. Apparently, the town of Scotto Bay is having a festival and the regular ferryman broke his leg. They're offering a hefty bonus due to such short notice. The ferry goes to an island that's famous as a camping spot, so it'll be pretty busy, but it'll still be easy money. I called them and was on the road within an hour. Okay, so we're gonna be a ferry money. Eh? Pause to move. Check the checklist. Tracks. The one filling in for me. My ferry is likely older than you, but she's a good girl if you treat her right. Important. Do not wreck my boat or I'll feed you to the fishies. Okay. Oh. Ah, I see you made it. Who is this? Why, I'm the owner of that there ferry. Didn't you get my note? Oh yeah, nice to meet you. Just be kind to my boat and we'll call it a pleasure after. Uh, you know what you need to do? Yeah, seems simple enough. Very well then. Just press that there button to raise the gate. Let's get a move on. Okay. Raise the gate to allow cars to approach. Drag cars onto the boat. You can load up to four cars, but it's okay to leave with fewer. Watch for stragglers and try not to run behind schedule. When the cars are loaded, press the button by the ramp. ferry practically runs itself and will automatically stop when it reaches the opposite dock. So no risk. Next lane, please. Go ahead. On you go. Okay. And then... And this one. Ah, listen to her engine her. She'll keep a steady pace as long as you hold that lever down. Ah. Okay. So far, it doesn't seem too scary. I I shouldn't get a... So they set up to four. I've been making these trips for as long as I can remember. It's very quiet. As it should be. Press the ramp button to release it and direct each car off. Rinse and repeat. Okay. Press the button by the light ramp, it'll lock automatically. Okay. There's something in the water to my right. Might just be a rock. I have a feeling I'm not gonna have a good time. I think there's vehicles up ahead. There is, in fact. No gate on this island, so just load any waiting cars and wait back to shore. Have a good night. Drive safely. We're all set. And we run over to this guy and let him in. Take the open lane. All right, look at us. We're a fairy. We're a ferryman. Would help if I put this up. All right. I don't trust those but the water. Really don't. 
And load up the but it's okay. Watch for stragglers and try not to run behind schedule. Try not to. I feel like I'm doing a good job. I did only grab three people the first time. I wonder if that's gonna mess me up. But not bad, not bad. I got people up ahead. I closed the gate, right? Yeah, I did. Oh, I got people up ahead. I'm curious what the horror aspect of this is. I heard something. It sounded like footsteps. Oh. Maybe that's the horror. You just hear stuff. Hmm. Drive safely. Damn storm is ruining my weekend. I'm here. I'm here. I'm coming to get you guys. Sorry for the delay. Take the open lane. By the sea, this is a busy night. On you go. Anyone else? Just the two? Creepy, man. I don't trust the ones that talk to me. I don't know why. Ah, oh, this, this isn't, hmm. I don't know what I was expecting, but so far it isn't that bad. I'm getting unsettled though. Like if that makes sense, like I feel a little unsettled. Also, radio guy hasn't contacted us. I was expecting to just keep getting dialogue. Don't know why. I don't like this kind of back and forth kind of fairy work. So it seems like it'd be kind of interesting. Do I hear seagulls? Also, that one person said damn storm, but what storm? I haven't seen any signs of a storm yet. Oh, I'm also curious how big this campground island is. It'd have to be pretty big to house a lot of people, right? Enjoy your evening. You're all set. Welcome to Harborage Island. Hey, bud. Come on ahead. Hope the storm isn't a bad one. What storm? People keep mentioning a storm. Also, I'm kind of getting a little unnerved at this point. What was that? I don't know if the mic picked that up, but there was a loud click. That was weird. Is there a storm coming? What gave you that idea? A passenger mentioned it. Uh-oh. Ah, yes. Just checked with Coast Guard and a freak storm is brewing out to sea. Oh! That was a boat. Hello, boat. That was weird. Okay. And I'm over here just doing my job. Okay. Had the gate closed. Every so often I think that the gate is open and I don't know why. Tell me why. <laughs> Um, 
trying to keep myself. That's a lot of people. Uh oh. I gotta hurry. Have a good night. I'm coming, folks. I'm coming. Are you for the wait? Take the open lane. Next lane, please. Go on ahead. This is going well. Oh my god, that guy teleported. Well, this is going well. Sorry, I'm just checking. Gotta keep an eye on things. You never know what's gonna happen in the darkness. So how do you like it so far? I could get used to this. Well done. You have any questions for me? Tell me about the festival. Legend has it that there was a fishing village here once. One night, the village was destroyed and the survivors built the current town. That was 200 years ago to the night. Nice. A bit of history. So it's the town's birthday? More like a memorial to the old village. Shore life is full of hazards and we shouldn't forget that. That is true. Living on the coast of any major body of water can be pretty hazardous. But, like, if you have a livelihood, it tends to be worth it. I wouldn't mind living on the coast. But I, I prefer my deep forest living. It's my ideal. I want to live out in the bush. Enjoy your evening. Have a good night. May you be blessed. I don't know what that means. Enjoy your evening. Let's go pick up this other group. Well, this is going well. When's it gonna take a turn for the worst? On you go. Those campers weren't happy about the evacuation order. Evacuation order? What evacuation order? Oh, there's another vehicle. Almost left you behind. Next lane, please. I feel like I should. Man, your license plate reads shit. S H S H eight can be read as shit or shite. Shite. It reads shite. Evacuation order, but then I shouldn't be taking anyone across, right? Like, to the campground? Like, logically, that'd be the situation, right? Hey, watch it! I heard that all the way over here. It sounded like I hit something. Just try to pay more attention next time. I want my ba boat back in one piece. How the fuck did I hit? What the fuck did I hit? I have no idea what I did. That was bizarre. I didn't even see anything. Weird. But creepy. Oh no, there's a vehicle waiting. I was gonna say, uh, there shouldn't be any vehicles waiting now, right? Since, you know, the evac order. What did I hit? That did not sound natural either. That sounded creepy. Okay. I am. Um, I don't know. It said this was a hort sh uh, short game. But I don't know how short. They're all set. Enjoy your evening. You're the creepy one. 
Drive safely. Okay, none of you said shit to me. That's interesting. I left the gate up. Oops. Next lane, please. Okay, here comes some people. I was like, that was a bit weird to just see the one. Anything out on the water? Go on ahead. On you go. I think that's good. I don't think we have a fourth coming. I thought I saw something on that little island. Did not mean to do that. Okay, I am watching that water. As I get too close to the mic again. I'm watching that water. Not seeing anything. Hold on, where'd the island go? There it is. See something. Every so often it feels like I'm going down into the water. that I heard clink of metal and I was like what sounds like the old girl stalled don't worry it's nothing complicated like a fuse box or anything just head below and you'll find a valve turn it and she'll be right as rain That was easy. I'm going, I'm going. That scared the hell out of me. A fucking horn honking. God damn. Can't blame my paranoia for kicking in. Asshole honking at me. I was trying to go. Jeez. <laughs> uh. I don't know how long, how much longer this goes. Like, I, I'm curious. Because... Yeah, 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 I'm going, I'm going. Have a good night. Drive safe. Our service to the town will not be forgotten. What? We're all set. You're the one that honked at me, you dick. Hello! I'm here. Go on ahead. Take the open lane, please. Oh, we got someone coming. Oh, we got two more people. We get a full load? What a bloody time. Next lane, please. On you go. None of them spoke to me. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay. Coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, strange note. They're lying. Leave before they find out I warned you. Um, okay. So, uh, how was the old village destroyed? Nobody knows. Probably was just a freak storm like the one we're expecting tonight. Or a huge wave come on to shore like one of them their tsunami things. The kids think it was revenge. Revenge? Yeah. Sailors come to town with their stories and the kids eat them up. The kids are always talking about ghosts and goblins. Bro. Uh huh. Hey, look, kid. These freak storms are no joke. And there are more people to evacuate. Let's focus on that and we'll talk tall tales after everyone's safe, okay? I'm gonna try something. Because the note tells me that they're lying and to escape. So what happens? There's no cars. If I immediately try to leave. 
I left the gate up. Why is the gate down? I'm gonna try and leave immediately. I'm not sure if they, uh, I want to stay. This place gives me the creeps. You know what? Screw the money. Aha! I quit. The next morning you awoke to hear a Scoto Bay was destroyed in a freak storm. Good thing you quit when you did. <laughs> I got the quit ending. <laughs> well, uh, because of how long that took, we'll leave it there. Uh, just because I unfortunately don't have time to play through and try and get to the other ending. So thank you guys so much for joining me. As always, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. It really helps the channel. I'll see you in the next one.